Greetings and welcome to Rudy Eats. I am your host, Rudy Eats. Today we are sampling a product that I thought I had missed out on. This is Mountain Dew Pitch Black. Pitch Black was a product that had been put out of from the uh, stables of the Mountain Dew flavor arsenal. Let's examine the pitch blackness of this soda. Uh, it's actually a very dark purple, very dark purple color. It's not technically black, but I'm not going to. If it's blackberry, that would make a lot of sense. This is the black tie-in, but I'm going in blind. Did no research on this because that's how we roll. My virgin mouth experience for that sound. I'm, I'm just going to try it. Mmm. Smells like chemicals and berry. Mmm. That thar is a grape soda. I love grape soda. I love good grape soda. This is not my favorite grape soda. Uh, I may be biased on this because I'm a connoisseur of grape. I assume this is grape. It may be, have some blackberry undertones in there, but it tastes like grape. You know what? Let's be scientific about this and find out what this flavor actually is. And consulting the all-knowing oracle of Google, what is Pitch Black Flavor Mountain Dew. Okay, I found this on the web for what is Pitch Black Flavor Mountain Dew. It is officially flavored as black grape. Whatever that means, but... It's good. Uh, it has a definite grape flavor, and you do detect the citrusy signature Mountain Dew undertones. I give this a would consume. A uh, connoisseur that I am, I have to say that Welch's grape soda is by far the best grape soda that I've ever had. And uh, it beats this both in flavor and color and aroma. But uh, this is a solid entry into the mainstream market. You don't see a whole lot of grape. And uh, would I pick Baja Blast over Pitch Black? Uh, I would have to say I'd like the, uh, the Baja Blast because uh, I would select a different uh, grape over this one. So thank you for joining me, and I will see you next time on Rudy Eats.